Thank you for choosing Dark Light Cinemas, and please, please, please enjoy this presentation of The Faded Fates. I know I will. Thank you. How was that? One of your best yet? Really? Thanks. You do know what I'm gonna say, though. The joke? The joke! I was worried it might be too much. You know I have a ton of respect for Mr. Damon. Trenton, anyone who knows you knows you have nothing but respect for Matt Damon. But audiences these days, they've got one hand on the Twitter button at all times, you know what I mean? Yeah, and what if Mr. Damon shows up? Or his agent, or his accountant, even? Exactly. <sighs> Although, Mr. Damon does have a wonderful sense of humor. He might think it's funny, and if I could make Matt Damon laugh... I think we have to ask Kyle. On the other hand, it's our job to set up the film for success. It's heavy material. Shouldn't we lighten the load with a joke? Is there a chance that Matt Damon might be there? And what about his accountant? You know what I'm gonna say. Do what Jokes Mr. are for Damon jokesters. Do. No. Do whatever the hell you want, weirdos. But under five minutes. Okay, look at me. That is the maximum amount of time you are allowed to speak to the audience. Got it. So that's a yes? That's a blind yes to the joke? Sounds like a yes to me. Fine. Yes! Oh! <laughs> Wait. What are you doing? I think you need to hear the joke to approve it. I really don't. As our supervisor and the most important male figure in my life, I think you need to hear it. Don't tell the joke. I'm going to tell it. Please, don't tell me the joke. I have to tell it. It's important that you don't. I'm gonna go ahead and tell it now. I swear to God. Let me have this. Stop. I'm gonna tell it. Don't. Lord, I need this. Don't tell the joke! Why did Matt Damon win worst dressed at the Oscars? Why? Because he went goodwill Hunting? <laughs> we got a fan here. Potatoes.